Good morning, Grid Eleven. How are you? How was the weekend? Great. Okay, let's uh, identify our lesson today. Writing part two, an article. But first of all, let's identify our value for this week, which is altruism, which means disinterested and selfless concern for the well-being of others. Let's start our lesson with this starter. Are all are all people satisfied with their jobs? Yes or no? And justify your answers. Our objective today to plan and write an article in workbook pages twelve and thirteen. First of all, let me tell you some tips. When writing an article, give your article a catchy title. Introduce the topic in a way that will attract the reader's attention. Develop your ideas about different aspects of the topic in separate paragraphs. Expand on describe or give examples of each aspect to develop the idea in the paragraph. Use a variety of techniques, for example, ask questions, and read the reader directly, or Use exclamations, include expressions to make your article more interesting. Here is a model for an article about an ideal job. Pause the video and read it, please. Have you finished? After reading, you can take some expressions, vocabulary, ideas. Then come back to me to write an article about your ideal job. Here is the plan. Page 12, article expressing the writer's opinion. You are going to write about your dream job or your ideal job or uh, even unusual job. Give the title, give a catchy title in the beginning. Then how many paragraphs are you going to write? First one we can call it introduction. Make an opening comment about the topic you are writing about. You can use these expressions. Everybody dreams of having the perfect job. What comes to mind when you think about the ideal job? And present the job you have chosen. Then the main part there are two paragraphs here. First one refer to one aspect of the topic you are describing. For example, what is special about the job that makes it ideal for you? What's its value for the society? And what are the advantages or benefits for you? Then another paragraph refer to another aspect of the topic. For example, do you need any requirements or qualifications for this job? What personal qualities or skills do you have that make you suitable for this job? After finishing this paragraph, in your essay with this paragraph, which we can call it conclusion, make a general statement to some of your ideas. Comment uh, on how you plan to make the ideal job become a reality for you. You can use these expressions. Here is a question. You can uh, write your plan first, then go turn the page and write your article. Write about an ideal job which you would like to work in the future. Before you complete your plan, make some notes on the information you want to include using your ideas from Activity G on page 19 in the student's book. Find out more information about your ideal job by carrying out your own research using the internet. Start with the title, 
introduction which is uh, which can be an answer for this question what's your article about and present your job here the main paragraph one can be answered for these two questions what job and what does it involve job details I mean what is special about the job that makes it ideal for you its value for the community or the society and the uh, benefits or advantages for you the second paragraph in the main body the qualifications are needed for the job then the personal qualities or skills and in your essay with conclusion how do you plan to make your ideal job a reality turn in the page in workbook and write your essay here and the teacher is going to check it at class inshallah now dears it's my time to uh, tell you goodbye and see you soon inshallah